Join Lori Moore as she disconnects from technology and reconnects with the hands-on projects she loves. She might just inspire you to spend more time offline too. It's Lori. Merry Christmas. It's actually Christmas Day. It's not really Christmas Day. I pre-recorded this, but you're watching this on Christmas Day. So Merry Christmas. I am coming to you quickly today to share one of my most highly anticipated events of the holiday season. We just did this this past week. It is called um, our favorite things party and I get together with four of my girlfriends and we exchange our favorite things with each other. So I show up with four gifts. They're all the same, my favorite things, and I give them to each of my four friends and they all show up with four of the same gift and gift them to all of us. So we go home with our friends' favorite things from the past year. So it's so much fun. We put a price limit on it. So um, we all kind of stay in the same ballpark and that's pretty much the only rules we have. So we get together at a local wine bar and we had a nice charcuterie board and some flat bread pizzas and we just catch up and laugh and gossip and exchange gifts. So I thought I'd show you really quick what I got because I always love my gifts. They're so much fun and they're so unique. Everybody's so different. So here's one, the Shoe Away Fly Free Entertaining. So this thing you put out near your food at events and keeps the flies, the pesky flies away. Can't wait to try that. I got this great white magnolia candle a nice wooden wick. It smells so good. Look at this. This gorgeous vase has some fake greens in it. I already have a spot picked out. I've been waiting for this video so I could go and put it away. And I got this gorgeous wooden dish tray. I think I might use it for bread. It says Mary. All right, I got chocolate, dark chocolate covered almonds. I cannot believe I haven't broken into those yet. This is something I had never heard of. I didn't know this existed. It's whipped soap. I'm probably the only one on the planet that didn't know it existed. Um, my scent or flavor, I guess I'd call it a scent because you're not supposed to eat this. Um, Mary and Bright and this is soap, it's not lotion, So, but I'll dip into it to show you. It is like so soft and fluffy and it smells just like Christmas. And when you're not supposed to rub it into your hands like this because it's not lotion, it is soap. So I should be rinsing this off, but I don't have water right now, so I'm gonna rub it in. And I totally smell like Christmas. I smell like Christmas. I love it. All right, this was a fun gift. I'm gonna give a little plug to Studio Uplift and my friend Jade. Um, one of the ladies gave us each a um, pass for a free class at her new studio. So that will be something fun that we can all do together. So that was a really neat idea. And then I have, oh, look at this. Is this my last thing? Think this. Oh, no, I have one more thing after this. Now you all know where I live. That's my zip code. This is a key ring. I love that it can go on my wrist. It has this huge chunky clip on it, so I can just hook it to my bag if I want to. And I'll give another shameless plug because this is one of our favorite um, local shops called Locally Yours. They have so many neat things. So if you're in the Plymouth area, uh, Stop on by and check them out and take a class at Studio Uplift. Um, and then this fun canvas makeup bag that has an Aubrey Hepburn quote on it. And I filled this with a special note for everyone. And then my favorite hand lotion and dry shampoo and my favorite chapstick and some things like that. So there you have it. Favorite things 2021. If you've never done a favorite things party, I highly recommend it. 
I hope I've inspired you to spend a little more time offline, hopefully with your friends, and have a wonderful holiday season.